in honor of my mom and all moms we've lost. So I have no idea what's in here. I want her to come back and do all the irritating things that she used to do because I wasn't ready for her to go. All right, mom, <laughs> let's see what you packed. Okay, this is funny. My mom would pack thing in, things in any kind of bubble wrap that she could find, any kind of tissue, and so there's like four different kinds in here. I know these are just things, like, oh wait, there's fabric. <laughs> Don't you miss being crazy about people after they're gone? <laughs> Oh my gosh. She had a really good eye. And here's a bubble raggedy bag. <laughs> it's in a pillowcase. <laughs> I love that mom. <laughs> oh, look at that. Way to go, mom. Good shopping. Well, the good thing about opening this box is I have a whole new set of treasures to remember her life. And the hard thing about opening it is that this is the last thing that she gave me. More than two years later, grieving is just still so if you see any of these items online or in somebody's mystery box, you'll know that that was my mom's, one of my mom's last gifts to me, to this business and to supporting her granddaughter because some of the funds from this were going for my daughter's education. Is you, Thomas. If you are here right now, I'd love to hear all about your day. I don't even need to tell you about mine.